focus 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 hey guys welcome back to my channel i am back oh my lord i have so much to tell y'all so today's video um, is going to be about some underwear that I've tried out recently but before we get into that I just want to give y'all some tea on where I've been so yeah I am pregnant so we just gonna get right to it boom and so I'm gonna give y'all a quick little story time before we get into the review and then we'll jump into the review and we'll be done as you can see it's getting dark on me I had my ring light ready to plug in and it broke so how I got pregnant I absolutely y'all it was divine intervention but like that is the only explanation i have for this because i was actually using an iud when i got pregnant for those of you who was already judging me like damn girl look i just think god knew the desires of my heart and this is not to make anybody panic because i'm the type of person if i'm watching a video like this and i'm using what failed another person i'm gonna automatically think that's me don't do that to yourself my doctor said and every doctor that i've seen since i found out that i was pregnant has said that this iud that i was using is like the top gun of iud's so i was using the paraguard iud so i found out the day before my husband's birthday i couldn't remember when my period was that was first and foremost so i had had a physical at my primary care physician's office could not remember when my last period was so when they asked me I just made up a date I remember just feeling not a hundred percent like really really tired on and off nausea but I'm like there's no way I'm pregnant because I have like an IUD in and when I tell y'all I believed in this IUD more than I believed in myself I told my husband I'm about to go buy a pregnancy test because I don't know when I had my last period and I've been feeling real weird about it and I know I'm not pregnant but let me just go get a test because I would rather just have it out the way know that I'm not pregnant and you know just be over it and have that little inkling out of my mind peed on the stick and y'all like when I was waiting, like I had the digital. So I get the digital test. I didn't have time to be playing with no lines. Is that a plus? Is that a minus? Is that two lines? Is that one line? No, I needed to, to say pregnant or not pregnant. I just felt like that gut feeling like this shit is about to say pregnant. So I went downstairs. I told my husband, I didn't do no special rah-rah, nothing. I was just like, look. We about to have a baby. So basically, like me and him just kind of laughed about it, like, well, I guess we having another one and we just gonna roll with it. We're back on this journey again, and long story short, short story long, we are really excited about it. Let me know if you are a mom and have had any form of birth control fail you. Let me know a little bit about your story in the comment section. So now that that is out of the way, I'm gonna hurry through um, these pieces. I am gonna kinda like model the pieces for you, but I'm gonna do that in a voiceover since we are running out of daylight. I like items from both Skims and from Amazon. Um, and I'll just tell you what I like about each and what I don't like about each. Wait, I cannot believe that I am like wearing shapewear and that I'm thrilled about it. Like this motherhood has changed me so much. The reason I bought it is because I was like watching a lot of YouTube videos about what's in my hospital bag. And I was just trying to be prepared with everything that I might want and need um, while I was at the hospital. And I ended up getting the Amazon stuff. This is both underwear and loungewear for me i just came off of breastfeeding and when you are a breastfeeder you have to pretty much walk around your house naked like i wasn't like breastfeeding to the breast i was like pumping but still like these titties needed to be out because i needed to access them like i'm pulling this because this is like stretchy and i was constantly like flipping this down this is not one of those bras that clips like it just stretches down as far as you need it to go but i was constantly needing to expose my boobs um every two to three hours and that's so inconvenient if you don't have something that's like really stretchy i was really in search of something that would be nursing friendly comfortable and cute and also something that would shape me because i already was prepared for the little 
saggy fupa in the front that you have when you have a baby. I didn't know when mine was going to disappear. And to be honest, I wasn't as like self-conscious about it or worried about it or wanting it to disappear as I thought I was going to be. And I really had kind of started to embrace it. I'm just going to show y'all the Amazon pieces first. And we're going to start with the underwear. So I am wearing the white set, which um, it looks just like what I'm about to hold up for you, except for it's white. This is what the underwear looks like. I know it doesn't look flattering. If I'm going to have to wear some shapewear, I want to feel sexy in it. I want to feel like it looks good. Um, also, these came in like a pack. Um, I think a pack of like five, which I think came with three black and like two of the gray ones. And then I got a pack of the white and that was just all five pair of white. And I just want to say that that is one of the pros of the Amazon set. They are very affordable. So you get a pack of five and I want to say it's about 28, 30 ish bucks. The underwear wash is really good, especially the white is the elasticity. They kind of hold their shape kind of like that fresh out of the pack fit. So I also got me a pack of these, um, little bras and these are just like bralettes so i'll stand up a little bit so you can see but yeah this is it <clears throat> in the white that i'm wearing they also came in a nude color a heather gray and it came in a black so yeah i just thought when i saw these i was like i'm gonna grab these because they'll look so good with the underwear that i bought um, one other thing that I like about the Amazon pieces is that they are soft because they're cotton. I want to say that they're, well, I don't want to say they're a hundred percent cotton because obviously there's some elastic in the band, but they are cotton, um, to the touch and the feel the briefs are, and they're so soft and they feel so good. I would say that these wash well, I mean, obviously um to me the skims wash a little bit better um and i think that's just because of the material you know cotton tends to fade a little bit more than that nylon elasticy type of material but overall these wash really really good and i think that they bounce back and they fit your body very similar to what they did when you first open up the packaging these aren't as shaping they literally just kind of take the shape of you and they don't roll down like they don't really snatch you in but they they're they're gonna keep they're gonna stay up on you wherever you position them all day they're also comfortable not only to lounge in but to sleep in um the bras the bras are not as supportive i think it's more so because of these like these are very thin like spaghetti like angel hair spaghetti strap so they're not quite as supportive but i mean like the white one itself this is tight enough for me but again i have smaller boobs like i am barely a c cup and i think the only reason my cup is a c is because i just had a baby because before that i was barely a b and these are perfect for me um, it's really all the support I need. Now, I'm not gonna work out in these because um, I would need more support than that. I'd probably be jiggling a little bit. But um, as far as just day-to-day -day lounging or going to the store or wearing this just under a t-shirt, um, these are good. Okay, so just as far as the cons, I don't really have many cons for these either. Um, the only con I would say is that the bras do loosen a little bit after washes. So they're already not extremely supportive. They get a little bit less supportive after the wash. Also, the material can get, I mean, you can't really see it on camera, but they're just like the bras, like here's my black one. They get a little knotted. Like you see how there's like kind of lint sticking to them. So they're kind of like ribbed bras and the material it gets like a little bit linty in the washer the bottoms are not seamless like the skims like i was saying earlier you can see the seams but for these what i'm using them for i really don't have a lot of cons i think they're great for the price point very affordable um and i really love both so what i got from skims is like kind of looks 
similar it has like a similar silhouette a similar look to what i purchased on amazon oh gosh y'all i'm not prepared with the name let's see but this is their little brief as you can see it looks very similar as far as silhouette it does fit slightly differently and y'all will see that during the try on portion of this video but yeah i got that in this beautiful chocolatey brown color and this like coffee nude color now this is not like cotton cotton this is like that elastane type material and just so you know this um particular brief is not a part of the shapewear collection but it very much shapes and snatches you i watched some skims reviews and some people that tried to shape wear thought that it was just a little too excessive for them. So I didn't want to chance it and buy like shape wear specifically. I thought these were cute and looked very similar to what I was already wearing. And actually this still shapes you to me just as good as like a spank. Cause this was shape wear enough for me. Now I don't know, someone else might need something with a little bit more pull, but this was all I needed as far as shape wear. As far as the tops, I got two bras i got one bra that is very similar to what i'm wearing um this is very soft material like this bra is so soft and it washes really really well and then i also got like a bantu top which i love bantu tops and this is what the bantu top i purchased looks like it's almost like a grayish brown what I really like about the skims, like the pros of the skims is they're very like controlling and smoothing. This is like a band. You can kind of see that line of demarcation right there. It's going to snatch you. So it's very like control top. It smooths the curves out for you. I like too that it's seamless. The only thing about the Amazon is that this part here, like around your butt, you can see the seam. These appear to me to be more seamless. And one thing about these that I noticed is that they do kind of go inside your crack a little bit. I hate when my butt eats underwear. And I don't even have no like big old butt, but I just don't like underwear that like slip even just a hint inside your crack. But these, even though they do a little bit, it doesn't bother me. It's like, it's like it's in there just a hint, but it doesn't feel like you have a wedgie. That was another pro. Um, one more pro is they wash really, really well. It's just so smooth. It's just, it's just not gonna knot up. But one thing I was worried about was like the bralette, um, but it didn't. It, it still washed really good. It looks like it did when I took it out, took them out of the packaging. Another pro for the bras is that they are very, very supportive. So these um, Skims bras are very tight across here, like not uncomfortably tight, but they they support you really, really well. Um, the only cons that I could really think of was that they are kind of like expensive like but that's just in comparison to like the amazon like so like for one piece of the skims i got a whole pack from amazon one pair of like the briefs were probably like 28 to 30 dollars um i think the bralettes and the bantu were like 25 27 dollars i will say that i feel like i got what i paid for and these are some really quality pieces Okay, y'all, so my daylight is gone. Like, I was trying to hang on for dear life, but I felt it just getting darker and darker and darker. So, yeah, we're gonna finish out with just normal lamp and overhead lighting, and hopefully this does not look like trash. Overall, I would spend my money on either or. I'm definitely gonna go back to Skims and purchase some more items that were sold out when I ordered the last time. And these are just some things that as they get worn, and older I will just replace and replenish as needed so yeah
yeah that looks like that is everything that i wanted to say about each item i hope that you guys found this video helpful and i hope that you enjoyed it too i'm really glad to be back on youtube and if you haven't already make sure to subscribe to my channel if you like what you see here and also comment down below if you have tried amazon basics or skims and don't forget to answer my question mamas have you guys gotten pregnant on birth control specifically the iud and i will see you guys next time.